most likely from the Kakanda deposit, Katanga copper crescent in the Congo. On a solid dolomite matrix, we have this formation of cobalt and calcite. These fruits sitting in this in this uh, drab barren ore, also known as Salrosa uh, matrix. Not much happening there. Um, let's just give it a closer zoom here. Very difficult to get an accurate color. Um, I think technology hasn't uh, given us total accuracy on the pinks and the greens. I struggle too with the diaptosis from the Katanga. Um, so there we have an all-round view. This hollowed out rug sitting over here. I'm going to zoom in on that section. Now typically I'd expect to find some heterogeneity here too. Um, but uh, from what I can see, we're looking at uh, cobalt and calcite associated with calcite. So when we display it, we can display it this way around too. Looking in on that section, going across, across like that. Going to that lovely fruity section. I wonder if we don't have some underlying quartz crystals there too. Well, that seems to be the cobalt and calcite also. All the way from, uh, I believe, the Kakanda deposit in the Congo. Cobalt and calcite with calcite.